Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we have a new frame. Actually, this is not a new frame. This is a very, very old frame that I have been eyeballing for about a year now. This is the Martian 3. And if you can tell, it's completely different. It has something pretty much different than many other frames out there. Um, it has something called a squashed X or a squished X, which means it's not a stretched X nor a true X. It's squashed. So if you were to carry it sideways like this, you would see it turns to be a stretch X. So this is a squashed X frame. However, I forgot about this and I just ordered it the other way because I wanted to make a six inch budget build for the channel for a giveaway, which is going to be the next video after this. Now, you know, I wasn't going to make this video, but then I remember it was a squash Dex, and um, yeah, I've never really flown a squash Dex before, and I believe a squash Dex is what won the multi-GP the other day, if I remember correctly. I'm not really keeping track of that, but I heard something about a squash Dex. Anyways, so this is a cheap squashed X. This is a 6-inch X. This is a Martian 3. It comes in a 5-inch, and I think it even comes in a 4-inch, but this is the 6-inch version. Um, It does have an unbelievable amount of rigidity I, I really i couldn't believe it um lately i've been getting like 50 dollars frames and um they bend more than this you know and this thing is only held really together it's kind of weird actually if it's put together look at this little extra piece here this is supposed to be for your battery strap as i believe because you know there's really no way to mount your battery here so this right here would act as your battery strap and then these pins or sorry these screws would actually go down here Go through all this go into this part it reaches about there and you have this little screw here that just holds that into place and surprisingly it's holding pretty damn well uh something to take note of the really ac frames here is their screws are not the best screws that they provide they do tend to strip under pressure so just watch how much you are tightening up and if a screw strips i just a tiny bit i recommend you immediately remove it and throw it in the trash don't put it with your stuff because you know stripped screws can really ruin a quad especially in a crash you'll know as time goes on what i mean now overall i mean this thing is pretty nice it's a six inch um it's it's gonna be pretty heavy here actually let's go ahead and, and get its weight here there we go and there we go all right so it's on zero 125 that is very good actually uh you know for those big you know freestyle five inch frames if anything below 130 tends out to be pretty good very good actually um lighter the better obviously but for freestyle this is actually very good with all this stuff here so we could actually even reduce weight if we remove this guy remove all those four right there add nuts instead of them and we should be good to go however yeah, as you noticed here i don't have the camera plates installed but i'll be replacing them in very soon i mean overall i'm pretty sure there's a lot of reviews on this guy and um, a lot of people have probably seen him before however you know um, I've been wanting him for the longest time and I finally got him. Actually, I got him like a week ago. So this is going to be the budget quad and I have no idea how it's going to be. I know the components I could trust, so it's going to be a beast in that perspective. But the flight characteristics, I have no idea what to expect at all. I don't even know. Will, will two six inch fit here? I don't, because it's a squashed X. I don't know. But, um, yeah, this is a 250 millimeter wheelbase. So hopefully they'll fit so this is my attempt at a six inch budget quad and that'll be in the next video and it's going to be up for a giveaway once this guy is done and settled and set up this is going to be our january giveaway hopefully oh actually it is going to be so i mean i really can't say much this is squashed x every plate here is two millimeter except the arms the arms are four millimeter um the even the, the side plates i think here were 1.5 to two millimeters for the camera and um yeah, it's pretty nice. It comes with this little PDB kind of thing going on here. And I really like this. It actually keeps things very clean, um, this kind of things here. And um, this is not a clone of anything, as I believe. Hopefully, it's not a clone of anything. If it is, let me know what you think down in the comment section. And uh, don't be shy. Say whatever you want. And, well, that's it, guys. So um, I'm going to end the video here. I'm going to get started on building it so we can uh, get you guys entered into the contest. So stay tuned. And... Um, I'll leave the link. I'll leave a link to everything that I'm going to be using for the budget build down below. You can go ahead and check it out and um, yeah, get an idea of what we're going to be building. So I really hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you next time. See you guys. Take care.